Good morning, afternoon and evening everyone. I'm so pleased to welcome you all to the much awaited 2021 ACT Annual Conference, this time combined with our popular International Treasury Week. It's great to see over 1800 of you already registered from over 50 countries around the world, ready to accelerate strategic change, which is our theme for this year, with agility, influence and opportunity. And I'm confident this year's annual conference will provide just that. I'd like to start with a big thank you to all of our sponsors and supporters who've helped us bring the global treasury and finance community together in one place for four exciting and stimulating days, with a special thank you to our co-lead sponsors, HSBC, Deutsche Bank and NatWest. As always, we have a packed agenda, which you can browse through by individual day via the tabs above. On each of the days, you'll find the session titles and times. And if you click onto a session, you can read about the fantastic speakers that will be joining us. You can also view all speakers by clicking on more at the top and then speakers. We've listened to and taken on board feedback from last year's event and introduced a new filtering option on our agenda where you can filter sessions by day and topic. You'll also find a link to on-demand content for pre-records and live sessions once they're finished, and one for our new discussion zone, where we created different forums dedicated to specific topics, including LIBOR, ESG and sustainability, Brexit, cybercrime, the future of Treasury and working patterns, and more. You said to us you'd like more discussion with other Treasurers, so we hope you take the opportunity to involve yourself in this zone throughout the four days and beyond. Via the Exhibition and Networking tab, you'll find all the delegates registered for the conference. Do make sure your profile is up to date, as this is where you can network one-to-one, -one, should you so wish. Just click on your profile on, top, on the top right to update it, and look out for a green dot by someone's picture, which lets you know they're online right now. Click on a person's name to make contact in the various different ways available, or to set up a meeting later. By the same tab, you'll also find all our exhibitors, including sponsors and supporters, and a handy filter where you can find companies by sector. We have representatives on hand from every exhibitor ready to chat with you at their individual exhibition stand. So do take this unique opportunity to forge new relationships, submit an inquiry, and or look through and download the many helpful resources on offer. In fact, the platform is so intuitive that wherever you see a sponsor logo in the on-demand sessions or across the program, simply click on it and you'll be taken through direct to their stand. And also watch out for any prizes that might be on offer there. And just to flag, you have the opportunity to join a Zoom call with representatives from HSBC on their exhibition stand taking place tomorrow, Tuesday 15th of June at 11.15 BST for a webinar on HSBC Asset Management Liquidity Insights, which talks about future risk committee subjects for treasurers. And please do visit Lloyds, Lloyds Bank stand on Thursday the 17th of June, also at 11.15 BST, for a short session on payments in a pandemic, innovating in a time of crisis. Another highlight of the week is my interview with Andy Ransom, the charismatic CEO of Rentical Initial, who talks to me about leadership. And I was so excited to hear that his company had come up with a product that is 1,000 times more effective than the usual ones that kill 99.9% .9 of germs and viruses. It's called, actually, Virus Killer, and I'd encourage you to have a look at it for your office, as I'm doing for mine. So a little plug there, but it, I hope that's useful information to you. Remember to visit us too on the ACT exhibition stand, where our team will be happy to help uh, with any questions you might have. You'll also find various drop-in sessions here at the ACT stand throughout the week regarding the Financial Services Professional Apprenticeship um, ACT training and of course the Future Leaders in Treasury group. We also recently launched a new initiative to support treasurers in multinational organisations. So if you haven't already done so, please help us by completing the ACT International Treasury uh, Peer Review by the ACT exhibition stand and the stand of our partner for this research, Deutsche Bank. You'll find the details of this and more in our handy conference planner, new for this year, on the Home tab, 
which highlights what's on throughout the four days and helps you get the most out of the conference this week. And now back to our exciting agenda. Coming up after this, we have the world in 2021, the geopolitical trends impacting today's treasures, followed by a session looking at megatrends and the future of treasury with NatWest. HSBC will be speaking at midday on managing supply chains and working capital in a post-COVID, post-Brexit environment. After which we have a selection of corporate case studies for you to choose from, covering content from diversity and inclusion and treasury innovation through to intraday transaction visibility. And don't miss our special keynote at 2 p.m. where I'll be interviewing the Governor of the Bank of England, Andrew Bailey. The afternoon sees a selection of Treasury Labs for you to choose from, which will explore themes such as sustainable finance KPIs, best practice in M&A driven risk management, and the ACT Business of Treasury research. And we close off the day with a look at lessons learned, the impact of 2020 on corporate risk management in association with Lloyds Bank. Remember, all live sessions will be on demand by the end of the day they're shown and the event platform will remain open for 30 days after the conference, so you'll have plenty of time to catch up if you miss a live session. If you ever need a well-deserved break over the next 30 days, you can click onto our timeout zone via the tab above. There you'll find our wellbeing hub, which features a whole range of relaxing and stimulating resources, including a guided med meditation from one of our own staff, Angela Meringo, and you'll um, also find in the Time Out Zone the latest issue of the Treasurer magazine, which is available to all delegates to download for free and contains the full report on the ACT's 2021 Business of Treasury research. And also that's where you'll find the leaderboard for this year's exciting Treasury Hunt. So for more details on how you can earn points for the Treasury Hunt and win one of our great prizes, including a Series 6 Apple Watch, just click above on more, then Treasury Hunt, and good luck. So without further ado, I'm delighted to introduce our first session, the geopolitical trends impacting today's treasures with Parag Ghana. Have a great first day and I hope to catch up with many of you over the course of the event. So you'll have read Parag's biography, which is very impressive. I won't repeat it all here, but for those who've just tuned in, Parag is founder and managing a partner at FutureMap which is a data and scenario-based strategic advisory firm. He's a leading global strategy advisor, world traveler, and best-selling author. Uh, Parag's latest book is Move, The Forces Uprooting Us, published this year, which was preceded in 2019 by The Future is Asian, Commerce, Conflict, and Culture in the 21st Century. Welcome, Parag, and over to you.